Alright everyone, this has been a long time requested, so, oh, here it is, I've waited long enough. Alright everyone, here we are, 3k special, thank you all so much, look at this team, we're going to get the win with this team, I promise you, it is going to be so awesome. Oh my god, okay, so, the whole thing, I planned out, I made a raid chart, I don't often do raid charts, because I hate them being spread, rather you just watch the video, obviously, but, whole thing's planned out, we've got Pro Stratosaurus and Delo Rakyrus, perfectly boosted to be faster than the Velociraptor, everything's max boosted, the boosts have to be correct, or else, this raid doesn't work, so, Pro Stratosaurus minus, that's instant distraction, very important, the uh, cunning strikes here, obviously to attack the lowest HP, which is Velociraptor. So, Proceratosaurus and Dilorakaris together team up to take out Velociraptor. And then, because Proceratum Minus has instant distracted Mortem, it means Majunga is now the highest damage, meaning the stun will target Majunga Zorus, right? And it's now stunned, it can't do anything. So, next we'll take it out with a Rampage, basically, because Either Draco Stratosaurus can do uh, 5k or Pro Minus can do 5k. I think we use Pro Minus to attack. Because luckily it works out too because Pro Stratosaurus is faster and also Dealer Rakaris are faster so they can both distract. And because Morton doesn't have the distraction anymore, obviously, just fully distracted, it means the jungle will have most damage. So. Minus is going to attack the Jungasaurus. Oh, I love how it works out. It's so satisfying how this just all works. Like, Proceratosaurus, Proceratosaurus, and Draco Stratosaurus, Proceratosaurus, and all his hybrids basically in the one raid. And they just work as the most perfect team combo if you have them with the exact right boost. All of them are level 30, except this level 29 Proceratosaurus, because I was kind of desperate looking for a Proceratosaurus. I probably could have found one, but I left it till the last day. Unlike Cat, I actually like, meh, we talked in advance about this strat, and I said, she showed me a level 30 Draco Stratosaurus, I'm like, oh, I need that for the boost shuffle. So basically, this video is pre-recorded, but I really wanted to save it for 3k, because for 1k special, we did Pro Stratosaurus alone versus Morton, then 2k special, we did Pro Stratosaurus and Dota Curious double rare, so two creatures for 2k special, one creature for 1k special, obviously. And what's this? Three special creatures for the 3k special. So, we're all full once again, Mortem will be coming with that coin. I decide I would go distracting impact, why not? We'll fully distract Mortem next with Proceratomimus' instant distraction. And Draco Stratosaurus is allowed to go cleanse here because we can't distract, so we may as well get as much damage off as possible. Because you need, and I'll tell you, we actually need a crit in this first round for it to work successfully or else we're kind of in a bit of trouble. Now, that's basically a 1 in 20 chance. So if you think about all the attacks adding up, that's like every 20 attacks. And you're getting somewhere close to that. Like, the first round lasts 4 rounds, right? So, that is basically 20 attacks in total. Meaning that... Uh, one of the 20 attacks will hopefully be a crit. Although, actually, you've got the heals and instant distraction, so I'm kind of wrong there. But, oh, my pro, you guys know, my pro Stratosaurus loves to crit, even though it's like a 5% crit up, it loves to crit. And that is exactly what happened here. It was so good. So, Mortem is fully distracted, and Dealer Lachiris was allowed to heal. There you go, there's the crit. And... And then we've got the Cunning Strike, which is extremely awesome. So, next we'll be able to take out Mortem Rex. Uh, Pro Strathomimus, we're going to use its Rampage. We, we aren't going to use it next round. We aren't going to, for, we aren't going to use Pro Strathomimus' Rampage this time to take out Majungasaurus. Instead, we'll change up what we're doing and use something else, which will be pretty cool. So... D. Lyricarus, cunning, 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 all of them, four cunnings. 
Mortem is fully distracted. We're on, oh, besides Draco Stratosaurus, but it, it can still survive a crit, even if Mortem Rex were to get a crit with a cleanse next round, so it's close enough to being full HP, and I'd say it's pretty good. So, yes, we need Pro Strathomimus to wrap HE up to do as much damage as possible, and because Draco Stratosaurus is maxed attack, right? <laughs> even with a cunning strike, that's 2 point, almost 3k with a strike, a base strike. So, yeah, you see here, everything has to be perfectly boosted. The Draco Stratosaurus needs 125 speed to be faster than the Junga. It needs that max attack and the health, I guess, to make it... I think it needs the most health in the raid. I might be wrong. So, this looks dumb. This looks extremely dumb, right? We're going instant distraction with Pro the Minus. Why would you do that? Mortem's about to cleanse. You're like, pro proceed. You've been teaching us not to do this against cleanse. Well, anyone, any creator who's saying this, any person in the community has been saying, do not use, it's just common knowledge, don't use this strike against cleanse. However, like I said at the start of the raid, it will half Mortem's attack for now until it cleanses. So that allows Draco Strasaurus to do its rampage. The Junga gone. We've dealt with all the minions. Is basically the home run from here. So, oh my god. Okay. The cleanse. So, yeah, this is pre-recorded. But, um, I haven't looked at it since I recorded Look, look crit, right? <laughs> 17, everyone, I told you. I made sure they were all perfectly boosted. So that we could survive that crit too. Because, jeez. So, both Proceratomimus and Proceratosaurus under 100 HP. Draco Stratosaurus just above 300. Oh, jeez. Um, so I've gone Distracting Impact, so that means next I think we can fully distract Mortem. Now, problem is, Dealer Rakaios cannot heal everyone to above Mortem base attack. It will heal by about 2k, I think, maybe, but means I think one creature will die. Take your guesses right now, which creature do you think it will be? So, we've got Draco Strasaurus, basically final hit for this round. The Rampage, it's going to target me. Thank goodness Dealer Akaris was able to fully heal because I didn't take too much damage. And I believe, even with Dealer Akaris group healing here, because we're going to do that, I distracted impact. So that means I've already stacked a distraction, meaning... We've already got all four distractions we need on Mortem Rex. So, it's going to do zero damage here. I'm on full HP. I can survive a crit next round. Everything's all good. Problem is, you can see Pro Strathomimus cannot, and neither can Draco Strasaurus. Now, the difference about Pro Strathomimus and Draco Strasaurus is that Pro Strathomimus actually has an evasive stance. Whereas, unfortunately, Draco Strasaurus. No, it doesn't. That is, yeah, so I think you can tell what's going to happen. The only one with, the only pro Strasaurus hybrid without pro in its name is the one getting finished off, which is pretty funny. Um, only pros allowed here, but still. We've used all of them in this raid, so that's good enough, right? <laughs> We're not getting better than this. Maybe we could, but I highly, highly doubt it. So, the Draco Stratosaurus buff from this um, update actually really helped this raid. Thank goodness they did that. I don't think we'd be able to do this raid without that buff. So it was perfect timing and the boost shovel too because we couldn't have done this without boost shovel. We could have but we would have wasted so many boosts. So we did this then. It was pre-recorded back then and ready for now where I'm just reacting to it because oh it's so satisfying every time I watch. The first well, the, every time this is like my second Actually, I think I watched it once before, just to like, check everything recorded properly. So, thank goodness a crit didn't happen there, because Dealer Akaris only just survived, and thank goodness Mortem did not pierce through that evasive. That means we are so close, Mortem is just over 10k HP. We're about to win this, guys. So, I'm going to do Distracting Impact, and Pro Serathomimus, just to be safe, is going to do instant distraction, 
so that Mortem, like, because we all know that Rampage would do even half 3, 3, 4, 2 damage, which is, imagine if it crit 2, that, would, that wouldn't be good. So, may as well play it safe, go to the instant destruction, and I think Pro Strath Mimus has its Rampage next, right? And if both Dealer and Kairos and my Pro are attacking, and Pro can do like 2.6k with a Rampage, Pro Ceratosaurus, and Dealo can do like 3k with an Impact, oh sorry, did I, mean, did I say Rampage? Pro Ceratosaurus I meant Impact, obviously, but Pro Ceratosaurus Mimus, gonna get the final hit here, and I think it is safe to say we have one. Oh, the coolest raid ever, in my opinion. Just cause <laughs> everything pro Ceratosaurus related is in this raid, and we've got Mortem Rex. Basically, actually, it's like evolution over time, taking out the newest gen, right? Cause pro Ceratosaurus is like the earliest ancestor of T-Rex, and then Mortem Rex is like the evolved T-Rex. I don't know if you can. It's just funny, I don't know, there's the win, there's the screen, unfortunately Joker Strasaurus passed on, but that means only the pro survive, it ignore the thing Kairos, because it's not one of, part of the pro family, but still survive because, I don't know, maybe Draco Strasaurus, just like, it need that pro in its name, Drake Pro Strasaurus, yeah, oh here's our incubator, oh my god, that was so good. Yeah, this won't be the actual Morton DNA on that, just because I did the raid ages ago. Well, not ages ago, when the boost shuffle happened. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you all very much for watching. That was so awesome. I hope to see you all later. Hope you enjoyed this. Bye.